All right, Jay, we're at another photo op booth here. I love this one too. Look at this umbrella with the leaves on it. Tell us the inspiration behind this one. Yeah, you can pretend you're holding the umbrella here as you're underneath the <laughs> leaves as they're falling off the tree with all of the uh, nice fall items right around you. Yeah, I love the idea of the photo ops because it makes it even more exciting because you never know what you're going to run into with sure. each photo op on the bar uh, barn here, yeah. the farm. What did it take for you guys to kind of like come up with the ideas of what you wanted to put on the farm here for the photo op? Oh, just a lot of uh, going through <laughs> what other farms might be doing, oh, sure. um, looking through Facebook, yeah. trying to get ideas in different places and put them together to make them uniquely ours. Yeah, did it take long to put each of the spots together? It did. We, we, <laughs> we probably finished them up actually last week. I finally said to everybody, okay, now we're ready for the first of September. <laughs> you know, so it did take a little bit to get them together. Uh, the fun thing with our photo ops is many of them, were, we do a Santa night in December. December, and so we're going to leave them up and then switch them over to be Christmas oriented. So the, you know, so we'll yeah. probably put, make this have snow on it and Christmas oh, trees on the side of it, so you can come take pictures. Oh, awesome! Well, there's a lots more activities going on here at the farm. So uh, can we get into a little bit about how the apples are processed as well as pressing some cider? Sure. Okay. Sure. Well, let's go see it. All right, Jay, we're in the processing area where your apples go through. Tell us a little bit about what's going on. Sure. When our apples come in from the orchard, they're brought here into the sorting area. Uh, we have a hydraulics that empties our big field crates onto uh, these belts. The apples move forward. They go through this box right here where they're getting a bath. Uh, it's a lot of fun to ask the children on the tours, you know, uh, how many of you take a bath? Why do you take a bath? Because we want to get clean. Well, we need to have clean apples, too. We don't waste an apple, you know, either it's the bakery or for sale, uh, for eating, um, for cider or um, for animals, and then if it doesn't get used, then we compost it back into our soil. You have something new here. You got this new grain bin. Now, the last time I've been here, I don't remember it being this massive, so it's clearly new. Right. So tell us all about it. Yes, the uh, grain bin is an expansion of what we used to have. We used to have a little small building that had a corn in it for the children to play in the corn with pails and shovels and such. So this year we were able to make it about four times as big with a brand new wow. uh, bin and we're able to put windows in it so that uh, parents can watch their children. There's nice. benches inside for them to sit on and then the children go in and, and play with the corn and it can be really packed. It seems to be one of the most <laughs> uh, busiest areas here on our playgrounds. All right, Jay, well tell people if they want to come visit for the season how they can do so. Uh, we are open seven days a week. We are open um, 9 o'clock to 7 o'clock, Monday through Saturday, and 10 to 6 on Sundays. You can go online to greenapplebarn.com, and uh, it will show you how to buy your tickets online. Uh, it's, the tickets are, are less expensive if you buy them online than if you buy them at the door. All right. Well, thank you so much for having us. Yes, thanks so much for your uh, coming.